Good morning. It is January the 22nd in 2018, and we know who's going to the Super Bowl once again uh, from the AFC. It's never in doubt. <clears throat> well, it's always the uh, boss, the uh, New England Patriots, and I know there's a lot of disappointment in Minnesota right now, as in Jacksonville, but. Um, um, there's always next year, right? If you're a contender this year, you can be one next year. Hypothetical simulated performance results have certain limitations. Unlike an actual performance record, simulated results do not represent actual trading. Also, since the trades have not been executed, results may have under overcompensated for the impact of any of certain market factors, such as lack of liquidity. Simulated trading programs in general are also subject to the fact that they're designed with the benefit of hindsight. No representation is being made that any account will or is likely to achieve profit or losses similar to those shown. Well, here we are. Treasuries are lower. Why are treasuries lower? Fed is raising interest rates. And that's been behind the selling. Uh, the economy uh, appears to be accelerating. Equities are higher. Sell treasuries sell bonds and that's what we're seeing right now it's a um, auction week two seven year auction typically the market sells on Friday sometimes Monday and uh, it allows the dealers the primary dealers to get short futures and they'll buy those futures back to uh, support the auction that runs Tuesday uh, through Thursday of this week. Uh, we used to be able to count on two and three year auctions being strong auctions going up. That's out the window here. Uh, they can be weak, they can be strong. So uh, it's added a little bit more uncertainty to trading them, but typically strength on the first one, weakness on the intermediate term, strength on the longer term issue. So will hit tomorrow's market with those expectations. As you can see, volume is moving lower. Stops below, below 122 are within reach. Uh, so our first buy is 30 to 02, leaning against support right here. Then 21 to 25. This morning's news, Chicago Fed's National Activity Index was plus 0.15 last time. <clears throat> Nobody pays any attention to it outside of those that forecast. Sell 1, 7 to 11. 15 to 19, sell 2. Hope everybody had a good weekend. I uh, didn't pay much attention to football. Um, it's just kind of I gave up on Tennessee last uh, early October, and professional football <clears throat> didn't really get into that either, so no great sacrifice on my part. And with <clears throat> New England in the uh, Super Bowl, it's... Uh, be hard to watch that one for my for me. Okay, looking at the 30 year, uh, 28 to the buck. Number one, three to seven, sell one, and 11 to 15, sell two. On the uh, buy side, 16 to 20, number one. 9 to 13 by 1. And make it 29 to 01 by 2. Supposedly there will be a vote at noon today to open the government back up. But, um, I mean, the government really isn't shut down, so... In the stock market, you know, we talked about last week that on a government shutdown, the stock market would probably rally. And, and it did. And again, it just shows you the 
people have figured out that government shutdowns don't really mean jack. Um, uh, they see it as a political ploy, and um, economic growth is continuing. Um, buy stocks. And maybe, maybe the uh, Republicans will start showing some spine, and there might be a chance for start to get spending un under control somewhere down the road. That's a long shot, I know. But we t that's what we talked about last week and so far. That scenario is manifesting itself. Um, gold did get up to 35. Uh, looks like we rejected prices above 34. So 34, 36, sell 1. 39, 41, sell 2. On the uh, buy side, um, we'll make 28 to 30 buy 1. 24, 26 by 2. Turkey has invaded Syria. <clears throat> Turkey is threatening all those nations that supply weaponry to the um, Kurds. Now, you know, it's um, Turkey's never going to make the EU because of all of this. And um, NATO, I don't think anybody's going to count on them being a, a strong NATO member anymore. I think you'll see some of the military bases and such in Turkey being moved elsewhere. Looking at the Euro, now you talk about a trading range. We got a seller above uh, 123.25 and looks like we've got a pretty consistent buying definitely below 124.50 um, maybe a little bit higher so it's a 23.25 market and maybe a 22.25 market one full point things have gotten pretty quiet trying to trade higher right here uh, has run into resistance um, at 123, even so 123, 123, 10, sell 1, 23, 25, 35, sell 2. Uh, on the buy side, 50 to 60, buy 1, 25, buy 2. No news to drive the trading today. Uh, we'll see if the mark, if the government opens back up at noon when the next vote is scheduled. I mean, for most of us out there, who cares? Um, we, we're just not affected at all. We're still paying taxes. We're still maintaining all of our obligations. Um, not much of an impact. Okay, looking at crude oil. Uh, crude's not paying a lot of attention to what's going on in Syria, so we're trying to trade lower. So it's a um, a sell, definitely at 63.75. So 63.50, 63.75. Little good stops above 50. A limit sell here at 38 for the structure. So maybe 30 to say 30 to 38 picking up this area right here we'll have to see how that's potential resistance and then <clears throat> 64 even 64 25 sell 2 on the buy side 62 75 63 buy 1 and 62 and a quarter 62 50 buy 2 Can the E-mini <coughs> extend Friday's range and make another new high today? 
Um, we're pointed up. You can see volume keeps moving up on the distributions. We made a new high on Friday as we anticipated uh, with the government shutdown. We got a two letter ledge right here at 1250. Um, everything is pointed up, so 13 to 15 is B sell 1, and we're not really on the short side of the market. We like to buy weakness. Sell 2, 19 to 21. What we do know is they make us pay up to get long early in the session. Um, five, 4 to 6, buy 1. And then 28 even, 28.02, buy 2. Nat Chicago National Activity Acti Activity Index that was a mouthful. It was on the last report plus 15. That seems to be a pretty popular number. Sometimes can get as high as plus 0.3, but again, no one will pay any attention to it. Okay, it's going to take a bit to get everything up and posted. I will get busy on that. I will be back with you as soon as possible.